Hey guys, it's your boy ready for some FTP action and today we are trying something new that I have been trying for months now and I failed every single time and I just wanted to share with you guys my gameplay, my thoughts and my first time clearing maybe if I can get it. I tried a couple of times before this video, recording this video so I am pretty sure that she can do it and he can help him do it. So we are gonna be using this team right here and if you are for, I mean if you are any familiar with this team, you would know what I'm talking about. We are talking about World Boss Ultimate Clear and I'm gonna use the Deadpool Sherlock method. And my Deadpool is built pretty well. My Sherlock is not built pretty well and Sherlock is the main damage dealer in this method. And White Fox is gonna be using for the all buffs effect by 45-40% which is really great for helping Deadpool put more defense down on the bald boss so that Sherrock can just massacre with the tier 3 skill. So speaking of my Deadpool, it's it's not the PvP Deadpool but the thing is I am trying to get universal books for my Thanos tier 3. I just got one for the first try on Mo World Boss Ultimate and I just thought that, that I'm not gonna be using Deadpool in any of the world bosses today or maybe for the upcoming two or three days until I get 10 universal books so I thought that it would be a great time and it would be a good to make use of my Deadpool I know he's built pretty well but he will do negligible to no damage he will do one or two I mean damage in once to even more because even more requires energy attack characters to be cleared and Deadpool is just a physical attack character so it won't affect the scores or anything like that so I'm just gonna do it and I'm gonna charge the, I'm gonna just button smash all the skills of Deadpool. Then I'm gonna do the sixth skill, which applies all defense down. Then I'm gonna do the third skill and the first skill it is. Yep, first skill and the third skill together to get the all defense down stack up on three of the skills. Then I'm gonna switch to my Sharon Rogers. And when Sharon Rogers tier three skill is ready, I'm gonna just do three into five cancel into the sixth one because I definitely do wanna need that 25% crit rate because I don't have a max crit rate. So I have 49.82 so it will put me around 74.82 something like that crit rate which is really good because it is 75 is the cap and I'm getting 74% 82 so it will be really good comp it won't be as uh, bad as it looks because my Sherog is built uh, actually not pretty decent I know the stats looks really good but the thing is I don't have any Urus except these two one mythic and one legendary energy attack Uru and I have nothing I have no Urus except this one as well and I have no Urus at all for crit rate, ignore defense, I know these are rod max crit rate, crit damage, attack speed, I don't have any of the Urus and I'm also missing a lot of energy attack on his gears and his uh, obel her obelisk is the crit damage and 140 proc <laughs> which is seriously trash. I mean my Sherog is tier 3 for a long time now, it's been I think 4 or 5 months now, I think around 4 or 5 months. And I should have put on, I should have put something better. But I mean, since I started the game, I think this is the Oblix I have for it's over and over two years now since I have, I have this Oblix on her. So I definitely need to change it. She does have a overdrive stage 12 bonus, which is really good. And all skills are level six, but mostly we are gonna be focusing on the sixth skill, and then we are gonna be using White Fox for the buffs buff effect, so that the defense down can stack up more, so that Sharon can do more damage. So let's get right into it. So here we are, we are on Maw, I'm gonna do, I know Maw is not my boss of the day, but I'm, I need two more books as I, I can show you here. Uh, I need 70, 70, yep, I think I need 76 CCF and two books for Thanos tier 3, I'm pretty close. So I hope I can get some mooks and let's get this done. I, I need to clear it in 150 as well as 100 seconds. So I think I can do it with Sherog and this method. And I have already set up this team. White Fox has lead, and Sherog. Then I have some strikers, uh, which is Sue for the, I think, Antis or something. Charm, yes, Charm. And uh, for Antis, for time freeze, I know it won't affect, but it it is also giving 10% increase of energy attack, so it doesn't matter. And then mind control, I need all the crowd control I can get. And let's switch out this here. I don't know why I have here. So let's give him, let's give, I don't need 
HP because I'm just gonna finish him, finish it as soon as possible. So I think I'm gonna with this because it gives 10% increased damage to super rune types. Let's go with this team. Let's try this. Oh shit! I'm not very good at this team actually because I tried uh, this team before, but I failed miserably, and <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna clear this. I'll be really happy. Shero clears it. The thing is, I don't have that good build of Sharon right now, and mostly because of that obelisk, I definitely need to switch that out. Some good damage there. Okay, I think I'm almost ready. The stars is up. I think I can do it. It's getting pretty close, but I think I can do it. I'm sure he is ready. Let's do it. Please, man, control him. Okay, you can die. Come on, we are time. Woo! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Sherlock did it, man. Wow! I <laughs> oh, we got another book now. Nice! <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Let's see. Let's see. Let's unlock stage 50. I won't be able to do stage 50 because I already ran my Scarlet Witch and as well as <laughs> uh -huh. Psylocke. Let's unlock this. Boom. Nice. That's so, so cool. And I can do, I can get one more mythic box now. This was awesome. I actually seriously didn't thought that he he can do she can do it because she has a pretty crappy build and I think Deadpool Sherlock method is really amazing. I'm gonna definitely use him. And once I get my Deadpool to PvP build, now now if you guys know I have God 50 unlocked, I have Ebony 50 unlock and I am gonna be unlocking stage 50 Proxima as well. I only need two clears which I can get in two days or maybe one day with Captain America as well as Deadpool but I'm not doing it because I'm going for Unibooks but this is awesome and I, I used actually some of my characters like uh, Scarlet Witch and as well as Psylocke so I won't be able to show you guys the stage 50 clear but this was awesome. This was really really good and it was literally my first time in months trying the Deadpool Sherlock method and my Deadpool isn't even built for PvP so I was actually pretty not not pretty sure if I can do it but this was really good and I I think we cleared it in like 90 or 80 90 or 85 seconds. Yep, that that was seriously good. <laughs> oh man. We unlocked stage 50 and we are gonna be getting a new brand new mythic booty box. And I hope, I really, really hope that I can get some of these, maybe CTF, CTP of energy, maybe regeneration or, be, or maybe rage. I would be really, really happy. I definitely want some of these threes. I definitely want some of these CTPs. I'm, I'm seriously, I feel really bad when people score, outscore me easily and people are doing like 3 million and 3.5 million with cable and other stuff as well but while i'm only doing like 2 million and i was really disappointed by cable uh, i mean yesterday or on blast day i don't know yes yesterday or maybe two days ago depending on the time i was only getting around 1.6 to 1.7 million which was really disappointing because they buffed the beast's uh, attack Whenever he roars, he uh, his defenses grows. But the thing is, I was only getting 1.7. While before the patch, before the ABX Beast defense patch, I was getting around 2.1 to 2.4 million consistently. I mean, not very like every time I get 2.4, but I was getting 2. Point, at least 2.2. I mean, 
every single time i use cable on blast day so it was really hard heartbreaking heartbreaking because i have been using cable for ages now since he was introduced to the game and i love the character but we'll get it done we we'll, no problem we will work on our cards we will work on our stuff and it it's going to be really good because right now my cards are pretty good not the best but i definitely want to switch uh definitely don't switch this card i know this is really good card if if it had the cooldown on the 5.4% 5.4% cooldown on this set i know it's a proc but proc has only 5% rate when dealing critical attack so it is really difficult to proc but if it had the cooldown duration i would have just gone with the spidey card to uh, just uh, roll it pretty offensively we can get energy attack we can get crit damage and as well as physical attack so i can definitely make it really offensively and it's only a quality one so i'm hoping that i can do it i can do it pretty quick and let me know what you think about the video let me know what you think about the sherog sherog deadpool method and i'd never thought that sherog would be able to do 49 in 100 seconds i was counting on maluna because you know what <laughs> i'm going to t2 her i'm going to t3 her sorry I'm going to tier 3 here and I was thinking that she can do it because I tried with double support on stage 49 with my scarlet witch with my with my scarlet witch but the thing was that I could not get the kill it was like 3 or 4 bars left on the 100 second mark so I'm really happy that I'm able to do it right now so as always if you like the content I hope to see you again and let me know if there is any particular content that you want to see in the later videos I'll see you later